Welcome to this video. Today we will talk about a very important topic. How to recover your suspended Facebook account. Millions of users lose access to their Facebook accounts every year due to violations or suspicious activity. But don't worry, there are solutions and we will cover them step by step. Whether your account was disabled by mistake or due to a misunderstanding, this guide will help. Stay with us till the end. Common Reasons for Facebook Suspension Let's begin with the most common reasons why Facebook suspends or disables accounts. Number 1. Violating Facebook's community standards. This includes posting hate speech, harassment, nudity, or spreading false information. Number 2. Using a fake name or fake identity. Facebook requires you to use your real name and personal details. Number 3. Suspicious login activities. Logging in from multiple devices or unknown locations can trigger Facebook's security systems. Number 4. Spamming behavior. Sending too many friend requests. Messages or posting repetitive content can look like spam. Number 5. Using automation tools or bots. Third-party apps that automate likes, comments, or follows can get your account banned. Number 6. Multiple violations or reports. If many people report your account, Facebook may temporarily suspend it for review. Understanding the cause is the first step to solving the problem. Check for the suspension notice. Now let's move to the next step. When Facebook disables your account, you usually see a message when you try to log in. The message might say your account is disabled or suspended. Sometimes, Facebook sends an email to your registered email address with more information. Check your email and Facebook notifications carefully. This will help you know if the suspension is temporary or permanent. So come on phone home screen. If you lost access your Facebook account, and they are many failure attempts and other issues, so how you can fix all these things? First of all open Facebook. We suspended your account, 180 days left to appeal, or will permanently disable your account. Click on appeal. Enter an email address. Here enter email which your account suspended, and click on here, which says that send login code. Enter confirmation code. We sent a confirmation code to the email address you provided. Go to phone home screen and open Gmail. After that open new received from Facebook mail. And scroll down then copy verification code. Then go to back on Facebook. And here paste code which do you copied. Next. Record a video of yourself. To make sure you're a real person we need you to record a video selfie. We'll ask you to move your head during the recording to help us capture your face at different angles. Click on here that says record video. Start selfie. Enable access to your camera so that you can record a video selfie. Allow. Take a video selfie. We need a short video of you turning your head in different directions. Tips for a good selfie. Use a well-lit area. Hold your phone at eye level. Thanks for completing these steps. Submit this video to help us confirm you're a real person. Submit your video selfie. Identity confirmation in progress. We usually review your information within 48 hours. We'll send you a notification once we've made a decision. Finish. Again automatically we'll open new page for enter mobile number. We'll send a code via WhatsApp or SMS to confirm the mobile number you give us. Click on here, select country code which do you entering mobile number. Then enter mobile number and click send code. So my verification code has arrived. Copy code, and here paste code. If your code not received, after you click on here that says get another code, continue. Upload your ID. 
To help us check that this account belongs to you we need a photo of your official ID. This could be a driving license, passport or other type of official identification. If there are any issues, we'll send you an email. Take photo. Choose type of ID to upload. We'll use your ID to review your name, photo and date of birth. It won't be shared on your profile. For example, passport, driver's license, national ID card. If these documents not available to you, otherwise click here, which says that show more. Here is more options. You can select any one of these. For example, I select passport. Next. Take a photo of your ID. Using the camera on your phone, take a photo that clearly shows your ID or official document. Get started. Make sure that you can clearly read the text in the photo, otherwise your ID might not be accepted. Submit. Uploading your information. This could take a few minutes. After that close this page. Come on phone home screen. And open Play Store. Then go to search bar. Here type Facebook. Then open Facebook. And scroll down. Click on App Support. Here is some options. Click on Email. After that, here type, we suspended your account 180 days. Then explain your situation briefly. For example, my Facebook account is suspended haven't violated any of term and service. Seems it is a false suspended please help me to get my account reactivated as soon as possible. Enter account full name with email address and date of birth, which is on your suspended or disabled account. I attach this appeal in description. You can copy from the description. After that click on here. Attach problem screenshot and official government identify card and send this appeal. After sent appeal now go to phone home screen and wait 24 to 48 hours. After wait open Gmail. Then open new received mail. You are back on Facebook. Your review was successful. Thank you for taking the time to request a review. We reviewed your account, and saw that activity on it does follow our community standards, so you can use Facebook again. We're sorry that you weren't able to use Facebook for a while. Sometimes we need to take action to help keep everyone on Facebook safe. Again go to phone home screen, and open Facebook app, then log in your own suspended Facebook account. Here you can see that my suspended Facebook account successfully reactivate. Facebook usually replies within 24 to 48 hours, otherwise 1 to 7 days. But in some cases, it can take longer. If you don't get a response within a week, don't worry. You can resubmit the appeal form again after a few days. Also, try this second method. I attach second method video link in description so you can watch my this video and recover your own suspended Facebook account. We hope this guide helped you. Don't forget like share and subscribe for more helpful tech content. Thank you for watching.